morning once again so we have come to the programming in scratch here yeah? we have come to programming in scratch and in programming in scratch we like to do with the new one that is a scratch uh, the old one I have shown and today I'll be showing you the new one that is the scratch 3 and you'll find that more or less is similar but some uh, advantage is there because you have the it's um, like uh, advanced version so uh, this is how we load that scratch so scratch is being loaded previous one on my told about the offline one and this is the online one so it has been loaded and you find the scratch screen in front the first screen and the first window of the scratch and then you find that uh, you have uh, the addition of the sprite how you will be adding the sprite and this is called the sprite you know this picture is called the sprite this object over here there's a cat by default and if you want to change it you can go and change the sprites okay for changing the sprite you need to uh, you need to move and change to the particular thing so over here suppose I move I want to move first first I let me use the cat uh, sprite and I want to move it so I take it and over here this is my area I will be using this one so I can even use this one so this is the start of the thing so once the program is made we can make the start but over here we move this one so let us first start with the particular thing and uh, also I like to say that there are other things also how to add a sprite how to delete the sprite and you have how to move the sprite how to turn the sprite so uh, and you even can change the um, color of the sprite and you can also make the sprite talk so how you can make the sprite talk in between and this is you find this is a you can choose from here the icon comes here you can choose it okay uh, so once you come here you can choose over here go and choose the sprite so you can change your sprite according to the fashion according the way you like you can choose this one okay okay you can go there and you can uh, and you can move that sprite if you want to move it from here you can move it so that is active and you can move it move see it moves on it's, it moves on away from the particular was back and now now we come over here you'll find the various categories of these right you can find animals okay you can find people you can find fantasy yeah fantasy okay you can find the dance yes the music yes the music is also there music okay the category of this choosing of the sprite sports there food is there fashion is there letters are there so you know like you can you can if you want you can bring from here the sprites so if you want to move or turn or go back to the left side of the thing you can move it you can select this sprite and you can move it in front like this using the move option so you can see this one now now if you want to if you want to enlarge the sprite so I move it more I want to enlarge the sprite you can do so by going here and uh, this one is active so you can enlarge it from the size so size I can make it as 150 so it will be enlarged okay just check is enlarged and you can you can just move now you can move this one so you select this one from here and you move move so all are clear and you can move and move further you can move this one also yes so everything is clear so this is a move command so the first command I have done I hope this is clear for you and then we will be going for the move commands as we proceed our class okay and so um, what we can do is that we can even turn we can even turn this one you see this can be turned see this can be turned from here see see it's turning so this is scratch programming so uh, these codes are there scores are there and see how it looks it's turn up and down is playing see it's going way up and down so this is the thing that it can be turned right by using things and so you see this thing you can even randomize the thing you can you can set to randomize thing also okay 
and how you do that suppose you come here so you will take the random and go to random so you just go back in the random position so these things are clear to you thank you hope you will learn more and more as you subscribe my channel thank you thank you everyone thank you all the best uh, do concentrate in studies now and you will be a good programmer